Hey, what is up people? This is Johnny and today's Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon tutorial video I am going to teach you how to capture Zygarde in Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon Believe it or not, you can still capture Zygarde in Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon But it's going to be in a different way You're going to want to go to Pony Island, you're going to want to beat the game You're going to want to beat the guys who are blocking the cave And you're going to go to the Pony Plains and you're going to go to the Pony Meadows As you guys can see in the map there On the left screen at the top right Or left, top left you will be able to go into this cave. All right, so make sure to have at least some Pokemon because there are going to be a couple of battles here. Um, I recommend have a couple of revives or something to so you can so you don't have to uh, mess up along your way in order to get your Pokemon because there might be a couple of battles here. Uh, since this is the this is one of the main areas, so make sure to have your Pokemon and make sure to have a decent. Pokeballs or Ultra Balls, stock up on them because it's going to be uh, one of those Pokemons that you just have to capture. And yeah, I don't know if you can swim in the water. Uh, you can fish, but not, not swim. Sorry about that. Alright, so it's been a while since I've actually been in the Resolution case, so I'm not going to lie. I, I don't really remember how to get there, but we are going to find our way to get there as well. Alright, there's a Pokeball there. Power Lens. Okay, that's pretty cool. Shouldn't really be that hard to get here, though. Um, you know, it's all pretty straightforward. I'm surprised we can use Toro to Charge. I don't even think there's going to be any battles unless there's, like, wild Pokemon. Just find the Resolution Cave, guys. This is the Resolution Cave. You're going to want to use your your Mudstow. Your Mudstow's Gallop. So let's go ahead in our journey. There's going to be a battle there. I don't want your battle, dude. I think I am going to be forced to battle. Oh, well, uh, oh, yep. I'm going to be forced to do a couple battles. We'll go along the way, guys. I guess we will have to take o on these battles. But we'll go along the way as we go. Hopefully these trainers only have like one Pokemon. It's, it's really annoying when there's like battles in the way while you're trying to capture Pokemon and do a tutorial for the video. Right, but let's see, guys. Let's just go ahead and battle these. Uh, they shouldn't really take that long. Uh, I I can totally wreck him. There you go. We took down that trainer, and we're able to continue on the road for Zygarde. And I, I did stock up on max repels because what's the point? There is no point to be <laughs> battling like crazy. Alright, so yeah, it's down this route, I believe. Maybe. Yep, it is down this route. As you guys can see, you just you see there Zygarde chilling. You know, he's like, what up, dude? You, you come here to capture me? Yeah, I do. Zygarde. There you go. That's how you encounter Zygarde in Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon. So it's a little bit different than the other games, but you know. He has his own cave. He has his own resolution cave, which is pretty cool. He has his own area. So make sure you don't have like overpowered Pokemon or else you, you won't be able to capture him. And I'm assuming that after you capture him, you're able to go back to the Dexio for it like hey dude I caught Zygarde um, can I switch his forms and he'll probably be like yes totally anyways guys thanks for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to Johnny Canal Nation